I'm delighted that um, Edgehill University has won the Times and the Sunday Times Modern University of the Year for 2022. This is possibly the most significant award actually available in UK higher education. People ask me, you know, why this award has been awarded to Edge Hill, and I think there are a number of factors. Further improvements in our teaching quality, in student experience, the way in which actually we've coped with the, the pandemic. And it's not just the Times and the Sunday Times Award. Just back in April, uh, Educate North identified us as their University of the Year. And also, actually, in the last couple of weeks, uh, we understand that the Times Higher has shortlisted the university for its outstanding contribution to the local community and also, and perhaps most importantly, outstanding support for students. I actually do see the university, I think, becoming increasingly recognised you know, for the excellence of what we do and also for the diversity of what we do. Diversity in terms of the students you know, we recruit, but actually also diversity of the curriculum and the portfolio. And we are very heavily engaged now in, in developing our work in the medical school, uh, but also our work in biotechnology, our work in computer science, and the work we're doing you know, in engineering and actually developing a very substantial engineering faculty. Edgehill University has become a very significant provider of STEM subjects. The people I want to thank are the people who are part of the university. And I think that runs right the way across you know, the entire institution, you know, irrespective of people's roles, be they support, be they administrative, you know, be they academic. And in the end, you know, the things which have helped us get this, for example, the improvement in our position in the National Student Survey, are based actually on the views of our students you know, and our recent graduates. And I think we also have an enormous debt to them.